All right, another video right before I uh, get ready for bed. I'm busy all day. Uh, <clears throat> here pretty soon, by tomorrow, there should be an option also on the website where you can donate. Uh, I haven't checked if there's been any donations yet. I haven't got. I've been so busy today. Not even my a lot of my friends have been trying to get a hold of me, and I, I just can't. You know, I'm dealing with this and other things, and and uh, anyways, I'm going to start off with an email, then tell you what happened that I just found out. Uh, with my son that is uh, just extremely strange and also uh, infuriating. If it was to happen to your child, you know what I'm talking. Your child, you would know what I'm talking about. Let me read you one another email. I told you I do this periodically throughout the day and throughout the week. All right, I'm not going to mention the name, but uh, it says um, here on this email it says I recommend enrolling your son Richard uh, in Rio Rancho Cyber Academy. It is a part of Rio Rancho Public School. There is no bullying tolerated there. I was bullied at Eagle Ridge Middle School for two years. In March 2010, I was in the seventh grade. I was beaten to the point that I required rehabilitation to walk again. I discovered RRCA. Now that's... Um, that is the uh, Rio Rancho Cyber Academy. You know, I discovered the uh, RRCA, and I love it there. I am receiving a full education in a safe learning environment. I understand how you are feeling, Richard. That's what he's talking to Richard uh, there. And he says, I commend you for having the courage to stand up to the bullies. Please consider Rio Rancho Cyber Academy. This kid was bullied for two years, beat to the point, According to him, allegedly that he was beat to the point that it required rehabilitation just to walk again. And this happened at Eagle Ridge Middle School. Okay, for what happened to my son today, I just found out he hasn't been eating. They haven't been feeding him lunch because they said that he owes $5 to an Albu Albuquerque school that he went to before. Because, uh, I guess, he owed $5.00. They said the only thing they could give him was, what was it, bread and cheese? Yeah. Bread and cheese. And yet in the school they teach about the f different food groups and how important nutrition is. And then they want to give you bread and cheese because you didn't pay $5 at the previous school you are at. Yeah, th this is getting deep. Tomorrow is time to take some legal action. Uh, if you haven't donated, please donate. Um, let's get this thing rolling. I, I got a lot more emails to read you, but I, I want to do one uh, or two at a time. Maybe I'll start doing more throughout the week at a time. Uh, I know I've been doing video after video, but I'm just keeping you updated. When I hear something like that, that just makes my blood boil. Uh, this school definitely it shouldn't even be deserved. Uh, one good thing, I have to say this, so I have to be fair. Uh, Richard said that the teachers teach uh, was the teachers were very nice to him today, but it makes you wonder why they are nice to him today. I wonder what happened over the weekend to make them just all turn on the nice switch all of a sudden. But anyways, I'm gonna end it with that. My son wasn't able to eat. I didn't know about it. Uh, and 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 Richard's kind of um, if you know my if if you knew my son, you'd know that he kind of. Um, he, he likes, he's a happy guy and he likes to keep everybody else around him happy. He doesn't like to bring up stuff like that. But you need to, Richard, in the future. You know, when stuff like that happens, you need to bring that up, so I know. Um, as far as I know, we paid that, by the way, too, at that other school. They didn't feed him. So, no, he didn't get to eat today, but he get to, he, if you saw my other video, you know, he got to be watched by, he said, more teachers than usual were out there. And, of course, after he walks outside, he, they wait a few seconds and walk out and follow him. So now they're following around the victim like he's some kind of criminal. You know, so that's what's going on. Um, I'm going to try to get some good sleep tonight. I haven't really had much good sleep since all this stuff went down, but I'll try to get some. Uh, but, like always, God's always good, so still, I'm going to say, you know, till next time, God bless and take care.